channel so today is friday so happy friday y'all hopefully wherever you work you had a short week so i wanted to take 10 minutes or less and film this video so it's not an unboxing because i've already unboxed it and i've actually been rocking it for about a week um my fitbit so if y'all been watching me and y'all know me you guys know i'm a fitbit girl y'all know i own an apple watch but i don't rock with my apple watch i just throw it on every now and then you know just just because but i love fitbits and i started out with the fitbit flex then i did the fitbit alter which i do have a comparison video on my channel which i'll leave up above and i'm comparing the flex to the alter so I'll leave it up above so that you guys can check it out if you are curious about what I think about the Fitbit and the Alta. But I decided to, once again, upgrade my Fitbit and I am rocking the Fitbit Charge 3. So, there were a lot of different options out there and I was looking at either the Charge 3 or the Versa. My mother and my grandma actually went with the Versa and the Versa is too similar to an Apple Watch to me and the... um size of it is too square and i like sleek things because i was actually skeptical about getting a charge three because i felt like it was gonna be too big for me but i'm loving it so really briefly i wanted to just show you guys what it came with tell you guys some pros and some cons if i have any and i'll be back in about a month or so and i'll give you guys another update but this is just like my initial seven day review with the charge three so let's get into it so i purchased my charge three from sam's club and i am a member shout out to motor and my mom i'm a member at sam's club so i'm able to go in early and i'm able to utilize all the deals so the charge three retails for 149 they had it at sam's for 139 and then i paid 150 with tax and at sam's when you purchase it, it comes like this. So basically it comes in this white box. It says Fitbit Bundle Pack Small. And yeah, it's I got the blue and gray classic band and it came with a black sports band and it has the rose gold aluminum case. So before I get into it and show you guys up close, let me show you everything it came with. So basically it came in here. And I love how it comes in this white box because it's really protective. And then when you open it up, you get two more boxes wrapped in plastic. So this is the Fitbit color scheme I chose. So that gray and rose gold. I actually chose that color scheme, the rose gold, to match my cell phone. I'm a matchy-matchy type of girl. And I typically only use black Fitbits bands because it goes with everything but i opted to try this one out since it came with black and i actually really 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 love this color scheme this gray and rose gold i think it's absolutely gorgeous so yeah this is what it came with um it comes with everything typical it came with a charger a manual and the extra bands and the extra bands came in its own separate box so what I did was I basically just put the gray band in here. When I took the black band off, I switched it last night. And it just comes in its own separate box. The difference between the bands are... Well, let me just pull it out and show you guys really quickly. So the difference between the bands are the pattern. So if you can see, the gray band has this type of um, raised bumpy pattern, which is super comfortable. And then the black has the hole pattern where it has like a lot of holes poked in it, which is 
reminded me of the new bands that the Apple Watches came with. So yeah, plain and simple in here and on the back, it has instructions as to how to switch your bands out, which is again, super simple. I got the small bundle, which means it comes with two small bands, but they also have a large bundle, which will come with two large bands if you're a thicker girl or guy. Um, they do have that option, which is dope. So yeah, that's what I got. So basically, I got the Fitbit Charge 3. This is an advanced fitness tracker. It's the new year. So again, happy new year. And I know everybody is trying to like jump into their fitness, myself included. I'm trying to jump back into my fitness. So upgrading my Fitbit was something that I really wanted to do because I have been rocking the Alta for like over a year. So I was like, okay, it's time to, you know, do something different. So y'all i'm actually loving it i love the sleek design so before i give you a close-up and kind of show you guys what it does let me just read directly off the box so i don't miss anything it's capabilities so this fitbit is swim proof unlike the alta it was not swim or shower proof so that's already one pro this is swim proof um it also has a 24 7 heart rate again unlike the alta the alta that i had did not track your heart rate so again this is another pro this fitbit also has the multi exercise modes that the alta did not have so you can kind of flip through your exercise modes and pick what you're gonna do which is really really dope um, it also has your apps and notifications come to your Fitbit, which the Alta did do. So that is something similar. And this has a seven day battery life. And I think the Alta had maybe like a four day, which was still pretty good, but it's dope having like a week of battery life. You can use your Fitbit with iPhone, Android, Windows, Mac, or PC. And again, it came with a small wristband. Um, furthermore, this Fitbit has multi has multiple clock faces and of course the interchangeable band so separately is swim proof workout goals and real time stats multi exercise modes um and it does also do your sleep tracking and it has personalized reminders and again it does remind you to move like every hour if you haven't moved which is really helpful for me because I sit at a desk so every hour it'll tell me like okay Danny let's walk let's do whatever let's get your steps so i really like that but another thing that is super dope about the charge three is that now we can track our periods and our cycles and it tells me like what days i'm ovulating and it's just super super dope um so i'm really 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 happy with it let me tell you some specs on the fitbit um this fitbit is made with gorilla Gra gorilla glass it protects your screen and aerospace grade aluminum and it keeps your charge three lightweight and comfortable from night to day which is true like i really loved my alta but i'm actually in love with this too like i love my charge three like definitely in love with it out of all the fitbits i've had this has been my favorite and again y'all i only been rocking with it for a week so don't give me a break but I really, really like it. So if I want to just get up close and personal, as you guys can see, it does have rose gold aluminum on the sides. I am rocking the um, black band, which I changed it to. On the back, this is where you charge it. And then the face is very sleek. So it does display the time, which is 1250, 1259. And as you tap it, it does give you stats down here. So it can do the date. Once you tap it again, it's got your heart rate, but it's not gonna display my heart rate because it's not on my wrist. But then it just has all your little stats. Like so far I've walked 1.93 miles. So, and I've climbed one case of stairs because it has a little stairway. And just as you tap it, it just shows you different stats, which I really like. And there's also a button on the side that you can press to turn it off or get you back to the regular screen. And then up here, these little feet kind of show you your progress throughout the day. If you've met your goal, which is so nice to just kind of glance down and see. I really, really like that. But as you can see, it has a really sleek look. Really, really clean, sleek look. And I'm just like in love with it. Um, I do recommend the Charge 3 thus far for a man or woman. It's not too big. And like I said, it has the alternative 
bands so that you can kind of switch them out depending on your wrist i have a small wrist i'm a smaller girl so yeah it, it, it's really 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 beneficial um i recommend anybody who's trying to lose weight or get on track to invest in some type of fitness tracker like i said this fitness tracker retails for 149 it was 139 at um sam's and i believe i paid 150 i believe i paid 150 and it was a good investment this was my christmas gift to myself and the reason why i went ahead and invested in it is because i legit live by my fitbit like i have multiple videos on my channel about it and it's it's handy for me but if you're serious about losing weight and keeping track of things then i think it's beneficial because you can also link your fitbit to um my fitness pal app and some of those other apps that we use to track our food intake so it's pretty dope um like i said i'll be back in like a month to kind of give you guys another update but i wanted to kind of bring you guys my initial reaction and kind of just start the year off with some fitness i know i used to do fitness fridays so i kind of wanted to just start the year off like with um a fitness video on friday i'm kind of thinking about bringing back fitness fridays i don't know if that's something y'all want to see if so let me know down below but yeah i just wanted to come and do like a show and tell my one week review on my fitbit charge three if y'all want to see more like techie videos let me know so yeah i'm just in love with it i think it's so cute but um if you have any specific questions, leave them down below. Make sure you subscribe, y'all. We're almost to 6K, so go ahead and subscribe. Tap that um, little bell on the side so you can get notified every time I post. And I'm going to leave up above throughout the video, um, videos that I've done on my Fitbits or fitness trackers or whatever. And um, before I go, honey, let's get into this hair, honey. Let's, let's get into it. Let's get into this look for the new year. <laughs> So I do have a video on this unit and I'll leave it in the description box below as well as up above. I did do a full review on this unit and I usually rock this unit um, in the middle, but I decided to put it on the side and I'm just like really feeling it. Get into this look, honey. Get into it. But I'm really feeling short hair right now and yeah but anyway guys thank y'all so so much for watching and i'll see y'all in my next video reporting live from the internet signing out back to you world bye guys